channel another day another vlog today we are starting off with something i've been procrastinating for the longest time and it is getting my hair trimmed <laughs> do you guys see how long this is it is like almost past my butt at this point and it is getting way too long even for me you guys know i love my hair long but this it's a little ridiculous, okay? It's getting stuck in my underwear, my pants. It's getting stuck on my cat pika. Like, it's getting to a point where it's getting hard to manage. Also, if you see my ends, they are very tight. So, we are in much need for a trim. I feel like it's this way for a lot of people with super long hair. We've all had some sort of traumatic story of getting our hair cut and it looking horrible. My story is that when I was in like first grade or something, my mom took me to the hairdresser and they said it was gonna be a trim and they gave me a freaking mushroom cut, okay? I looked like Asian Dora and ever since then, I've been traumatized. I'm only going for a simple trim, but I still get nervous. Like, <laughs> it's like trauma from when I was younger. I still get a little bit nervous. Anyway, I'm being dramatic. Let's go. Joe and the Juice to grab some food and do some work. It's a new season, new hair. Guys, what do we think about the new hair? I feel like it looks 10 times healthier than it was before. <laughs> and yeah, something about getting your hair cut when it's a new season just makes you feel so much more refreshed. But yeah, the real ones know when I crack open a beverage, any type of beverage, that means we're gonna be doing some deep cleaning, specifically spring deep cleaning. It is officially spring and I am here for it, okay? You can't do a deep cleaning without a fire music playlist. I got this It's giving end of the world type of vibes. It's just me though. I low key love this weather because it makes me feel so cozy, but also I get a sudden urge to start cleaning my entire apartment. <laughs> Cause you know, I'm already stuck in my apartment, might as well. But yeah, gloomy, rainy weather, very underrated. Very underrated. <laughs> is squeaky clean so now it's time for closet clean out time I like to do a big closet clean out pretty much every season because there's a bunch of winter jackets and like clothes in here and I want to save some space in my closet 
You know, now that it's spring, I probably won't need this like thick coat anymore. I'm gonna take any winter stuff that I don't need and put it in a suitcase and bring them back home to Jersey with my parents. But yeah, if you're watching this, here's your sign to do a little spring closet clean out. Put away the winter clothes if you don't need them. Comfortable in here. Oh, you made two different kinds. Pugogi. Pugogi? Yeah. And this is ice cream. And Fruit plate. As you can see behind me, this weather is not cute, okay? It is a staying in at home type of weather. I do not want to leave my house right now. It's been pouring rain all day, literally. Since we're staying home, you guys know I'm up to my crazy cat lady activity. So I thought it'd be a perfect time to do this cat DNA test that I ordered. It's called Wisdom Panel. Think like ancestry, but for cats. I adopted Pika about like a year ago, I think it was. And she's a ragdoll cat. But since she's adopted, I don't know exactly what her breed is. Like, she might be a little mixed. She might be just ragdoll. Now it's time to find out. Are you excited to learn, Vika? This is what it comes with in the little kits. <laughs> okay, guys, so the DNA test, they recommend that you test them at least two hours after your pet eats. And guess what Pika's doing right now as we speak? This girl is eating right now as we speak, so we have to wait a few hours. We will check back in. Alrighty, guys, we are back. Speaking of which, hey, Miss Girl. Okay, so here are the swabs. I'm supposed to put this, like, inside of her mouth for 15 seconds, apparently. I'm not sure how this is gonna go because Miss Pika does not like stuff like this. We shall see. Roll and rotate the swab between your dog's cheek and... Hi, let her smell it first. Yee, okay, she's putting it in her mouth. Yeah, we got Good girl, okay. I don't think she's supposed to bite it though. <laughs> she just smells her treat. I'm trying to sneak it in there. There we go, okay. All right, Pika, you did good, good job. She was starving. <laughs> she's at the edge of the table. You think you're about to fall off, bro. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. So your girl woke up at what felt like the butt crack of dawn because this morning I'm meeting Anna and Lexi. They're the Learman twins. And if you don't know who they are, what are you doing? They're like my two favorite people on the planet. They're one of my few content creator friends and I haven't seen them in literally like a year. They're visiting New York. And so we are going to take a solid core class together. But yeah, I woke up at 6.15 this morning and I might have to start doing that more often. <laughs> I usually wake up at like 7.30, but the sunrise at like 6.15, 6.30 in the morning, I've been missing out. So yeah, I'm excited to hang out with my girls today. Obviously I'm bringing you guys along with me. But yeah, anyway, I gotta get going. Let's go.
see that? It is 60 degrees outside in New York right now. It is not very often where we have good weather here, so we gotta take advantage. We are gonna go outside and go on a run in Central Park. The real ones now, I'm trying to be in my running era. We're working on it. This is the fit. It's giving runner vibes. It's gonna be me, my boyfriend, and my brother. We're all gonna go on a run. I already know there's gonna be so many people outside. Whenever the weather is actually good in New York, literally everyone and their mom is outside. I've actually never been running in Central Park before, so a little nervous. I've only been biking there, so we shall see how it goes. So guys, we are at Central Park. It is a gorgeous day right now. Sun is out. Wow. I could get used to this weather, you guys. It finally feels like spring in New York. I don't even want to run, you guys. I just want to like walk and enjoy the weather. Taking a little break, I ran about like two miles and then after that my body was like, nope. <laughs> I can't even tell you how many grandmothers and grandfathers I saw that just whizzed past me while I was running. It was honestly really humbling. Oh my gosh, your girl needs to work on her running. <laughs> Hello vlog, so your girl has a full face of makeup because today is actually a really exciting day. I am shooting a really exciting launch video for gonna give you guys a little glimpse of what I've been working on. I'm not gonna show you guys the front cover yet. More details will be on my Instagram, so go follow me on there if you're a real one. I have never done a launch video for something of my own, so I'm honestly really nervous, but it's gonna be a really fun shoot day. We're gonna be all around New York, running around, just getting aesthetic shots. I'm really excited. I'm gonna take you guys with me, of course. We're at the next shoot location. We're at the Manny Jenneth Cafe. They have like the cutest plants here. I'm obsessed. The brains behind the shoot. Yeah. Let's go. Just got finished with a full day of shooting. Tired and hangry, so we are headed to grab some Korean food. Let's go, my Let's favorite. Let's go. Bash is first time having Korean food. <laughs> Yeah. 